Hi, Joel Hickerson, Grindog.com. Uh, today we're going to learn how to draw dark line art. First thing, all right, with the dark line art, um, we're going to use very bold uh, sweeping lines and keep the details to a minimum because the lines are going to be so thick it's going to be tough to encroach. Uh, so we're, we're going to go, we'll start with, let's say we'll draw a lion today, a very simple lion. A circle for the mane, <clears throat> a circle for the head, uh, maybe a triangle for the nose, two circles on that side. Now what I'm drawing here are considered the construction elements. So what I'm doing is I'm drawing them very lightly so they can overlap, they can, uh, uh, I can change them very easily. Uh, but it also lends itself to a very simplified drawing. So here we go with the dark line art, and I'm, I'm using a Sharpie, uh, which is a very bold line. Again, we're going to keep our details to a minimum because we are dealing with a, a bolder line. And uh, the construction elements I've drawn, I'm going to come back and erase anyway. So if I deviate a little bit from where I've placed them, I'm using them more as a guide than as a dead solid accurate um, line to follow. Maybe the muzzle, maybe the eyes. You can do a little tongue if you want to do. Bring the little body around. We keep the uh, details to a minimum. done, at least you can start erasing all your construction lines. When you end up with your lion, uh, and again, the details are to a minimum, but you can come back and give your uh, figure a little bit of weight and what I usually do to accomplish that is to go around say the bottom of the circle and make that line a little bit thicker and that kind of grounds the, uh, the figure to the paper. It gives it a little bit of weight. Just the underside. You can kind of see how it's starting to get a little bit more weight to it. And that's a real simplified, bold uh, line art drawing. And that's how you draw dark line art.